are seeing uh, gas prices at a record setting pace. Many of us uh, think it's the gas station owners that they're making record profits as well, but apparently that's just not the case. WMER 2 News is Don Harrison talked with one owner today and has more. We are feeling the sting of gas prices here in Maryland. Maryland is just about the same as the national average, but it has seen an increase in prices almost by the hour, it seems. Maybe I shouldn't complain, but that's that's awful. Ed Gilhooley was filling up on Kent Island today. Nothing much any of us can do about it. And as gas prices are going through the roof, on top of that, everything else is more expensive. Well, we've all seen it. It's just gone absolutely nuts. As we've seen gas prices go up more than a dollar over the weekend, many motorists believe that gas station owners are raking it in. Actually, that's not the case. No, not making money off of it at all. Rick Colburn has owned Bay Bridge Tire and Automotive for 23 years. He's never had prices increase so fast before. Many people feel the gas is already in the gas station's storage tank. So how can the price go up overnight? Colburn tells me most gas stations get deliveries three times a week, sometimes every other day in the summer. A year ago, Rick tells us a gas delivery cost him $28,000. His deliveries now cost him $40,000 and he must pay that within a day or so of delivery. So when crude oil jumps in price, it affects him immediately. Six o'clock tonight, it'll go up to me seven cents, and my load tomorrow morning is going to be seven cents more, if not more, if I didn't get one for a day or two. Colburn and others actually can lose money now. Gas is high, so people don't drive as much. People don't bring their cars in for service as much either. As gas goes up like it's going, the credit card fees get to be more and more, and actually the credit card companies are making more on a gallon of gas than we are. We can do some things to cut our gas costs. Make sure your tires are properly inflated. That affects mileage more than most people think. If you are going to be still for more than a minute, cut off your car. Take your car to the shop as soon as you see a check engine light. That could be affecting the car's performance. So how hard will we get hit in the wallet when we fill up? If it keeps going like it is, over $5. Diesel will be over $5 this week. To take away some of the sting for us here, some California gas prices are now $5.92 a gallon. On the Eastern Shore, Don Harrison, WMAR2 News.